Leanne Kiefer. I'm a dental hygienist and I'm Director of Education for Crosstex International. Today I want to talk about the very important steps of a process that we do each and every day in clinical practice. And it begins when we finish patient treatment. The first thing when we talk about instrument processing is transport of our contaminated instruments from the treatment area into our sterilization area. When we leave the treatment room, it's important that our contaminated instruments are contained in a plastic closed container that's labeled with a biohazard. It's also important that we're wearing the appropriate personal protective equipment. One of the main pieces would be a heavy duty nitro glove. If you're using cassettes, they're still open, they're vented. So that's why it's better to put that cassette into your transport container. Remember, you can't sterilize a dirty instrument. We need to make sure that all the bio burden has been removed from the instruments before replacing them into pouches or packages for sterilization. This is either going to be accomplished with an ultrasonic cleaner, a washer, or a washer disinfector. This is part of the process that gets the instruments ready for the sterilization process.